Matthew, the 11th chapter, and the 28th verse through the 30th verse read, Come unto me, all ye that labor and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you and learn of me. For I am meek and lowly in heart, and ye shall find rest unto your soul. For my yoke is easy, and my burden is light. And while you're still standing, turn to Luke. Luke, the 15th chapter of St. Luke. The 4th chapter, the 4th verse through the 6th verse. And it reads, verse 4, When what man of you having an hundred sheep, if he loses one of them, does he not leave the ninety and nine in the wilderness and go after that which is lost until he finds it? And when he had found it, he laid it on his shoulders, rejoicing. And when he cometh home, he called together his friends and neighbors and sang unto them, Rejoice with me, for I was, for I have found my sheep which was lost. Amen. You may be seated. Amen. May God bless the hearers and doers of the holy word. And man, with those two passages of scripture this morning, I'd like to use for a thought today, and that is broad shoulders. Isn't that all right? Amen. Amen. I'd like everyone to repeat that after me. Broad, broad shoulders. shoulders. Amen. Amen. And you know, I know some of y'all know people who have broad shoulders. Amen. I somewhat have some broad shoulders. All we kind of had a kind of of broad shoulders and and that was a, a blues singer one time I don't know if any of y'all some of y'all may be too young to remember him his name was Bill Withers yeah. amen he, he wrote a song about uh, uh, entitled Lean on Me isn't that right? Amen. amen the thought of his simple little song was that everybody need somebody to lean on and I get a you know, when you got somebody to lean on, it makes you feel a little more, a little more secure. Isn't that right? Amen. You know, amen. And uh, 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 I have had children, and and some people sometimes they they come up and and unexpectedly they they kind of like lay their head on the shoulder. Yeah, Isn't that right? Yeah. Amen. I, I've got children here in the church, and and and, and they come up and. Amen. I don't ask them to do it, but they come up and they say, how you doing? And they, and they lean their head on the pastor's shoulder Amen. for some reason. And I remember my grandchildren, all my grandchildren, from the, from the oldest to the little. <laughs> Amen. They would always come up and lean their, their head on Papa's shoulder. Amen. Amen. It kind of makes you feel good. Isn't that right? Amen. Because if there's somebody doing you wrong, you're not going to lean on them. Yeah. They show on them. Isn't that right? That's, right. That's, right. That's right. That's right. And even up to this present time, my grandson, before he goes home, he come up and he'll, he'll lean his head on top of shoulder. It kind of makes you feel good. Yeah. Amen. And I, 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 I can tell you, that anyone here today, when you, when you go home today, try sometimes to just, just lean on somebody's shoulder. Amen. Amen. It makes them feel secure more comfortable about themselves when you can just lean on them. I know we all grown folk, you know, we're a little shy. You know, we don't want to feel like little children. Amen. But nevertheless, it still get good when when when, when somebody can lean and lean their head. Every now and then the wife will, will lean their heads on my shoulder and you know I try to hey big guy what's up with you. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man. But you know everybody needs somebody to lean on. Amen. Can I get away? Amen. Amen. Everybody needs somebody to lean on. But today we're talking about broad shoulder. Yes. Man. Have you ever looked for a shoulder to lean on? Mm. That is the question today. Have you ever looked for a shoulder, shoulder to lean on? Amen. Sometime in my life, you know, you don't want to share everything with any and everybody. You have certain people 
that you have trusted in your life, amen, you can go to them in confidence and, and kind of, yeah, I have to come out, can I borrow your shoulder a little bit? I, I need a shoulder, amen, to cry on. I need a, I need a, a shoulder to lean. I need, I need somebody that I can trust, amen, to, to share some, 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 some personal info with you. Isn't that right? Mm -hmm. Amen. And they, 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 they lend the shoulder, take time out and lend that shoulder and give you a kind, comforting word. Isn't that right? Mm -hmm. Amen. That is bad. You know, we need to stop some time and take time. That this is the thing that we are doing nowadays. We are, we are turning our shoulder away from, from folks. Isn't that right? Amen. Amen. Mm -hmm. You know, yeah, yeah, you know, you can yeah, yeah. no, 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 Amen. take time. Take time out with that individual. You'll be surprised how much loving and affection that, and, and respect that that individual will have for you. Mm -hmm. Amen. It doesn't cause you anything. Amen. But that's what you call, that's what I call, the put storing your treasures up in heaven. We have a, a safe deposit box. How many of y'all believe that? All the good things in life that you do that people say, well, if I wouldn't, I wouldn't have done it. But do it in, in the name of Jesus. Do good arms. And that, that which is good at going into that box and what, what rough and, and all of that stuff I talk about cannot defile that good that God, that you have done. Isn't that right? Amen. Amen. All of that bragging and stuff, you know, you do something about, yeah, you know, I did this for him and he, you know, that stuff don't go nowhere. It don't go about, about that high. But that stuff you do in confidence in the name of Jesus. Amen. See, we sometimes we got to forget all about self and think of Jesus. Amen. Mm. Amen. Mr. Barrow preached something. Well, what would Jesus do? Mm -hmm. Huh? What would Jesus do? Amen. Amen. He fed those boys and go right back. You know what, Larry? We got fed. I know. <laughs> well, How high is that going to go? Huh? Mm -hmm. Man, if I've done it, if I give you $5 and so when I've been bought liquor liquor well, that Lord, I help Mm -hmm. Amen. Lord, at least I have to. He tricked me. He thought he tricked me, but Lord, you were watching him all the time. You yes, knew sir. that he had to see That's right. in his heart. Huh? But Lord, I know you're going to bless me with more. Huh? Mm -hmm. Amen. Amen. Sometimes when life's disappointment beset us, my brothers and sisters, we search for someone can give us reassurance that everything is going to be all right. Amen. Can I get a witness, somebody? Amen. Most, the most influential and respect member of the families are often those who have, you see, big shoulders. Mm -hmm. Can I get a witness? Amen. Those who always seem to have willingness, you see, to listen. Mm -hmm. Amen. Well, and like I said, those who are willingly to listen. Amen. Amen. Sometimes they don't, some folk come, they don't seem like they repeat. But, you know, it, all they want is somebody to just listen to what they, got to, what they have to say. Isn't that right? That's right. Amen. Amen. So people like me, you know, talk a lot. Mm. Amen. All I want to do is for somebody to listen. listen. Sometimes we do things for attention. Can I get a witness? Yes, sir. Amen. I, I hear people coming to me and I, I, you know, and they go to talking and I go like, no, don't cut him out listening because he, I know, because he like me, he wants some attention. That's all he wants. A gentleman come out there one day and I was at the store. He said, oh, sir, that's a nice looking truck. And I said, thank you. He said, you know, man, that is something. And he just went on about my truck and I said, listen to him. Because all he wants to do is somebody listen to him, what he has to say. It's not all about this truck. He's he, he probably a man of, of low esteem. Can I get away? Amen. Amen. Somebody probably always told him he, he'll never amount to anything. Somebody probably told him he talks too much. Huh? Yes, Amen. So he just wanted to prove himself. That he, he, so somebody say a whole lot just so somebody can listen. Yes, and I just taken time out and I just got real comfortable with him. I said, yes, sir. Well, thank you. You know? And oh, and I know that I now watch this. And the more he talked, the, the more I got quieter, the more he started talking. So I said, well, Lord, I'm in it now. <laughs> Sometimes, you see, it is a father. Oh, yeah. And other times, it is a mother. Mm -hmm. Sometimes, you see, it's a grandparent. Are you listening, young children, mm -hmm. out there today? Are y'all listening? 
obviously. Amen. They, 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 amen. They, they listening. Amen. And on other occasions, it have been a child. But when, when those with broad shoulders need a shoulder, where can they go? Mm -hmm. That is the question. Mm -hmm. Can I get with me? Mm -hmm. Yes, man. Where? Where can they go? When those who are shouldering the responsibility of the family, carrying the buck of the load, mm -hmm. and sharing the multitude of problems, well. need a shoulder to lean on. Can I get a witness? Mm -hmm. Where, where do they go? Mm -hmm. they, they can't lay their knees on their own shoulder that will only give them, you see, a crook in the neck. Mm. <laughs> Crying on their own shoulder only uh, result in wet sleeves. Where do those who are loaded with burden go to find shoulder big enough for them to lean on? Well, well, well. Well, as Christian, my brothers mm. and sisters, we have learned that there is no shoulder like the shoulder of Almighty God. Amen. Can I get a witness? Amen. Amen. You know, some folks are very, you know, I can, I can lean on my wife, I can, I can lean on my husband, I, and God knows I love my husband, but, and God knows I love, but, but sometimes I need a shoulder beyond all other shoulders. Amen. Amen. Can I get a witness? Yes. I, I, I need somebody that I can take, take my burden to all of my problems too. And I know who I can share. Can I get a word? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. He can bear. Oh, yes. More. Hey. <laughs> then no other can bear. Amen. It is a broad shoulder able to sustain as many as I have needs. Can I get a word? Oh, yeah. If you have been carrying a heavy load of responsibility lately, it seems to get heavy at times. There is a shoulder, you see, to lean on. Well, right. well, Not only does God have broad shoulders, but he also has strong, powerful arms. How many of you believe that today? Yeah. Yeah. Amen. Amen. Hear that song say, hold me, Jesus. <laughs> huh? Oh, yeah. yeah. They make us, you know, they make us feel safe. Can I get a witness? Yes, sir. Come on. Oh, yeah, secure and protected, regardless, you see, of whatever the circumstances may be. Mm. Yes, sir. Isn't God good today? Oh, a strong, a strong writer, my brothers and sisters, uh, probably understood this truth when he wrote this song. It's an old down home song, and I'm sure many of you have heard it before. It said, I'm leaning mm -hmm. and leaning, safe and secure from all. Ah, all right. Leaning, leaning on the everlasting arms. Oh, Looking for a shoulder to lean on. Try God. Oh, yes, he has broad shoulders. Isn't God all right today? Amen. Well, our text today, my brothers and sisters, first consider that Jesus gives an invitation to all those who are carrying heavy you see responsibilities to bring to him responsibility we sometimes refer to them as burden but we all you see have them mm. yes. can I get a witness yes. often our responsibilities seem to increase at such a rapid rate that showing them seem impossible but Jesus said come unto me is that what he said? Yes. All who are laboring, shoulder burdensome responsibility, I will give you rest. Ah, how many of you need some rest today? Somebody yeah. been going through some fire and tribulation. Yeah, prepare my children to do that with you, right? Evil is present. Lord, I need some rest. Where can I find rest? Good. God Almighty. The strange paradox here is that Jesus should suggest 
that we can get relief from the weight of our responsibility by taking on added responsibility of living for him. Mm. Mm. Huh? Yes, sir. Ain't that all right? That good company to me, isn't it? Yeah. Let you know your, 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 all your good living and all your good deeds, amen, is not in vain. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Amen. Living for him. Yeah. When you walk out the church today and hold your head up high and lift your shoulders up, stick your chest out, huh? Mm -hmm. Say, I am somebody. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Jesus said it, my brothers and sisters. Jesus said it. Oh, yeah. He said, take my yoke upon who? You. Historically, the yoke was, you see, a wooden frame used to join two oxen together. Everybody remember those oxen? They had the, the ox and the yoke them together. Right. Uh, Amen. Amen. The head, uh, the yacht all together. Sometimes we operate, you see, like mules pulling a heavy load. Isn't that mm -hmm. right? Yes, sir. Yeah. We put a harness around our shoulder and we can attempt to pull our responsibility up the light and inclines of life. Mm -hmm. All by ourselves. Jesus said, get out of the harness and get in the yoke. Mm -hmm. Ain't that all right? Mm -hmm. Huh? Get out of the harness and get in the what? Yoke. Hmm. Because the responsibility you see you are shouldering are designed for two. Mm -hmm. Can I get it with you? Yes, sir. Amen. If two are pulling the same load, the burden become light and the yoke is what? Easy. Easy. Are y'all with me today? Amen. Amen. When Jesus said, take my yoke up on you, He's not only he not only meant that he would help shoulder your load, but he also said something else because while the yoke was a symbol of sharing burdens with God, it was also used uh, as a submission of one person to another. Mm -hmm. Can I get a witness somebody? Yeah. Oh yeah, the prophet, the prophet, you see, Jeremiah illustrated that the people would be free from submission to uh, King Nebuchadnezzar by removing the yoke from his shoulder. Mm -hmm. Jeremiah the 28th chapter and the 10th verse. When he says to us, take my yoke upon you, he means submit yourself unto me and learn of me and I I'll will make your burden light. Hmm. Yes. Isn't yes, it all right? Yes, sir. Oh, yeah. To, to, to get help with your responsibility, we must be willing to take off the old man and put on the new. Mm. Can I get a witness? Amen. 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 Sometimes we can't get no way like a we 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 feel we feel dragging that old man, but isn't that right? Mm. Every time we right, he pulling us back to the bars. Can I get a <laughs> every time we he pulling us to the casino? Well, Amen. Well. We trying to go to church, trying to straighten up, get a lot of filth out, and he putting a lot of filth and pouring over yeah. in our life. Isn't that yeah. right? Come on. Amen. Amen. We got to get off a, a rid of that old man and put on the new. Yeah. Isn't that right? Amen. I'm so glad that Satan hadn't got that hold on me. Amen. I always had a mind, amen, so I could think on my own. Mm. Ain't that all right? Amen. Right. Amen. You know, some people mind they get led to the uh, to the slaughter. Isn't that right? Mm. Amen. Led to the slaughter. And can't he help themselves? Mm -hmm. Can I get away? Amen. amen. We need to turn around and change highways. Yes. Isn't that right? Yes. A lot of people need to change highways. Amen. I remember a story of a man was saying that uh, 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 four or five men were riding in the car mm -hmm. and the man was going down a steep incline. Mm -hmm. And the driver was turning around and looking around in the back seat, talking to the guys in the back seat. Mm -hmm. One of the guys in the back seat told the driver, said, hey man, he said, don't look now, but we got to have a cry. Mm -hmm. Now you're with me? <laughs> Amen. We need to take 
uh, off the sin and put on righteousness. Well, well. Now you know it. Put on righteousness, my sisters and brothers. We need to take off doubt and put on confidence. Amen. Now you're with me. Amen. Amen. Folk run around, I, I, I can't make it. I, I can't do this. I, I, I can't. I, you know what? I can do all things. Yes. Hey, through Jesus Christ, who strengthened me. Can I get a witness? Amen. Amen. Satan controlled up a whole bit of lies and we find everything that he said. Can I get a witness somebody? Yes, sir. Amen. We need to take all wrong and put all right. Can I get a witness? Amen. Amen. Yes. Somebody be telling somebody, I know, Lord, when you, when you made me, you made me right. Mm. Can I get a witness? That's right. I know when you made me, you made me to be a man. Yes. Yes. Somebody, I know when you made me, you made me to be a woman. Well, mm -hmm. I know when you made me, Lord, to bear children. Yes. Can I get a witness? But Satan told everybody else they something else. Can I get a witness? Can I get a witness? Somebody. Come on, come on. Amen. Amen. Yeah, I'm not trying to pick on nobody. Sin is just sin. Amen. Can I get a witness? Amen. Yes, Amen. Amen. We ain't trying to pick on nobody, but we got to stand for that which is right. That is what you're doing is what you want to do on your own. But there is a right way and there is a wrong way. Amen. Huh? Amen. Yes. Amen. Take off bad, and we need to put on good. Mm. Can I get a witness? Right, Pastor. All these bad things we've been doing. Right. Every time somebody say something like we want to cut somebody out. Mm. Can I get a witness? Yes, sir. Uh, we say we, we holy go God feel baptized, believe with Christ. Somebody say something wrong that we say, child, hold my purse while I cut it. <laughs> so I, Come on, can I get a witness? <laughs> Huh? Oh yeah, oh yeah. We need to put on, take off bad and put on good. That's why, that's why Jesus said, take my yoke. Amen. That's why he said, take my yoke upon you and learn of me. And I will give you rest. Regardless of what you going through, regardless of what people are putting you through, talking about you, putting you down, lean on me. Huh? Mm -hmm. That's all he said. Then lean on me. Yes, sir. We should not expect Christ to share our responsibility and load if we are not willing to submit ourselves to his will and his purpose. Well, right, well. right. In a harness, the load, the load is heavy. Mm. But when we are yoked up with God, mm -hmm. my Lord, mm. The burden is light. Yes, How many of y'all believe that today? Amen. Let me see that hand if you really believe that. Amen. But every child of God has learned that you can't do it all by yourself. Can I hear it with me? That's right. Amen. 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 I'm so glad that God gave us help. Isn't that right? God gave man a helpmate when they gave him what a wife. Isn't that right? Yes, Huh? Why did God do anything? Why are we populated? Why? Why? I, I, I get confused sometimes with 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 right and in the wrong way. You know, he, 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 he gave man a woman so they could populate the earth, right? Mm -hmm. How can a man and a how can a man and another man populate the earth? <laughs> can I? How can another woman and another woman populate the earth? Well, well, hey, Amen. Well, well, if that's what you want to do, like I can say that's your own thing. Sin is sin, and there's a whole lot of other sin going on besides just that. Amen. Amen. So we did not pick on anybody. Can I get a witness? Come on. Amen. Amen. Maybe somebody, somebody might be viewing this uh, 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 video. Amen. And, and you want to kind of uh, uh, take another look and say, "Well, I, I Lord, I'm doing my own thing, but I, I want to do that which is right and pleasing in your eyes. I, I want to be the me, right. the she that, that yes. God made and intended for me to be." Amen. Yes. Oh, I want, I want somebody to, 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 to imitate after me. Mm. My children, I want to bring my children, somebody, oh yeah, to, to go out and be a preacher like me. Mm. So I, did, I want a kid that can go and teach like me. Mm -hmm. Can I get a witness? Amen. But every child of God had learned you can't do it all by yourself. While you are holding 
one problem, another should to break loose. Amen. And I get away. Amen. Use everything you have and you can't shoulder. Oh yeah, your load by yourself. You can use. You can use your. You can use your education, and the problem will be unfindable. Can I get a witness? Right. Some people think that they have education, mm. but you see, That's right. it doesn't matter how much you know. Yes, sir. But when it comes down to the end of your journey. Oh yeah, you're gonna meet the Lord, man named Jesus. Yes, yes sir. Can I hear with you? Yes, sir. Yes. Oh yeah, oh yeah, your education is not gonna get you into heaven. Amen. 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 See, that is an earthly thing, isn't that right? Yes, Amen. Amen. Now I'm not trying to deter everybody. Children get all the education you can. Yes. Be all that you can be. Can I get a witness? Yes. Amen. So you can have big shoulders. But most of all, keep leaning on Jesus. Amen. Can I get a witness? Amen. Your 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 experience and your solution, your solution will not defy anything you have ever seen. Mm -hmm. Your ability to move and turn, but you'll find that the problem is like quicksand. Mm -hmm. The more you wiggle, you see the deeper mm -hmm. you sink. Mm -hmm. Can I get away? Mm -hmm. Every every child of God knows that when responsibility get heavy that there is a shoulder to lean on. Well, well. When trouble seems to multiply, there's a shoulder you see to lean on. Mm. When trials get in our way, mm. there is shoulder to lean on. Oh. When I get filled with tears, mm. there's a shoulder to lean on. Yes. Yeah. yes. Jesus said today in our text, Come on, come on, come on to me. Mm -hmm. All ye that labor and heavy laden, and I will give you rest. Yes. Glory to his name. Mm -hmm. No wonder, no wonder, oh yeah, the songwriter, Dr. Watts, wrote, I heard the voice of Jesus say, Come on to me, and rest. Lay down, thy weary one, thy head upon my breast. And I came to Jesus as I was, weary, wounded, and sad. And I found in him a rest place and he has made me glad yeah, hallelujah yeah. Praise yeah. Lord. Yeah. 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 thank you thank you for it Lord. hey to the holy name amen finally yes, my brothers and sisters our text point out that Jesus gave an invitation to all when he said come unto me he did not limit it to the first 100 or first that came to serve, but he said, all oh, ye that labor and heavy labor, mm. that must say to us that there is no limit mm. to the number of people that can lean on God's shoulder. Mm -hmm. And I get it written? God's shoulders are different from men's shoulders. Samson was a man of God who had broad shoulders. Mm. And I get it everybody remember Samson? Amen. Come on. Amen. He was a powerful man with strong arms and his shoulders were able to bear unbelievable heavy loads. Mm -hmm. when, when his captors tried to lock him inside the city of Gaza, he arose and walked away with the gate of the city on his shoulders. Mm -hmm. Amen. Mm -hmm. Amen. Mm -hmm. What a mighty God we say. <clears throat> but for all of that power, Samson's shoulders were not strong as God showed. Mm -hmm. You see, because everything he got came from God anyway. Yeah. Sometimes we forget where we get all our power from. Isn't that right? Mm -hmm. We go to thinking, look at me, look what I did. I, my, my car, my, my, you ain't got nothing. Have I written? Everything that you got, everything that you ever will possess, God gave it to you. Amen. And I get away. Amen. 
Oh yeah, oh yeah. It, it's hard for men to understand the power of God. Oh yeah, the power of God is incomprehensible, inconceivable, incorruptible, and inexhaustible. Can I get a win? Whatever you need today, my brothers and sisters, you see, my God, my God, he's got it. Mm. Yeah. Have I got it with him? That's right. Whatever yes. you want today, mm. you see, my God can deliver. Mm. There are some responsibility that the Lord wants us to shoulder. Right. And But somebody here is trying to put them down. In First Chronicle the thirteenth, the story is told how David ordered the priest to move the ark. You see of the covenant. Mm -hmm. The Lord commanded through Moses that the ark was to be carried on the shoulders of the Levites. Mm -hmm. Can I get a witness? Mm -hmm. Regardless of the circumstance, you see, but David looked. Uh, David took a long look at the road and saw that it was rough and decided that the road was too rough for them to carry the load. Mm -hmm. Can I get a witness? Mm -hmm. He ordered them to carry the ark and the wagon instead yeah. of their shoulders. Yeah. Oh yes, and, and as the ark shifted from side to side, one priest, oh yeah, ran up to catch it as it slid backward and he was struck dead. Mm -hmm. Good God Almighty, there are some responsibility that you can't handle by yourself. If you try, they will kill you. Mm -hmm. Can I get a witness? Mm -hmm. But some people have tried it but suffer from high blood pressure. Can I get a witness? Mm -hmm. Some people have tried it but they suffer from migraine headaches. Well. Mm -hmm. Well. Some people have tired it, but they suffer from stress attack. Mm. Well. Some here today have witnessed that when your load get heavy, you can take it to the law. Yes. Can I get a witness, yes, somebody? Sir, yes. My. Oh yeah, no wonder. Oh yeah, the songwriter wrote, Did the world from you withhold all of this silver and gold? Mm. Can I get a witness? Yes, sir. And you, you have to get along with me, the fact. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, just remember. <laughs> just remember in his word. Yes. Oh, yeah, how he feed the little birds. Mm -hmm. Take your burden to the law. Yes, yes, yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And you just leave them there. Mm -hmm. Isn't God all right? Yes. Oh yeah, sometimes, oh yeah, burden seems harder than we can bear. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, sometimes, oh yeah, I load, oh yeah, get heavy yes. than yes. we can yes. bear. Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, sometimes, good God Almighty, you're going to be talked about. Good God Almighty, but don't worry, just take your burden to the law. Yes. Good God Almighty, and just leave them there. Yes, mm. Oh yes, yes so many times we take our burden to the Lord. Yes. And before we get back home, our burden will be the back home. Yes. But I stop by to tell yes. somebody yes. that yes. might be listening yes. today. Yes. Good God Almighty, take your burden yes. ah, to the Lord. Yes. Hey. Hallelujah. And then leave, leave them there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, I'm so glad that you see I, I serve a mighty God. Yes. yes. Oh yeah, who yes. had big shoulders. Too big, oh yeah, that there is beyond his ability. Yes. But God Almighty, you see, there is a, oh yeah, no valley too wide. For him the cross. Mm. And I get a witness, somebody. Mm -hmm. There he is. Uh, oh, yeah. No road to rough for him to walk today. Mm. Oh, Lord. And uh, there he is. Uh, no person yes. too lonely. Oh, yeah. For him the comfort. Mm. Mm -hmm. There he is. Uh, yes. No hunger 
to break for him to satisfy. Yes. Yes. And there he is the God Almighty. Oh yeah, no song too mighty for him to control. Oh yeah, no wonder I see said unto us a child is born. And the government to be upon his shoulders. Yes. The God Almighty even one evening, you see, over 2,000 years ago, yes, yes, the yes, God yes, Almighty, yes. my Lord and, and your Savior, mm, he took my sin and your hello, sin hello. way out on the old rugged cross. Yes. Can I get a witness? Uh, yes. Oh, yeah. And uh, put it on his shoulder yes, and uh, yes, he hung there, bled and died. Yes, the God Almighty that we all might have a right unto the tree of life. Uh, but good God Almighty, what do you mean? I like about it. Uh, good God Almighty, I know he went out. Uh, oh yeah, he gave his feet to the nail. Uh, and I know he gave his hand. Uh, oh yeah, to the nail. Uh, oh yeah, but, but what thing I like about uh, good God Almighty, this situation, uh, good God Almighty, but hey, that one Sunday morning, hey! God Almighty, hey, that one Sunday morning, I believe I'll say it again, y'all, somebody didn't hear me, hey, one Sunday morning, good God Almighty, my Bible say he rolled on the grave, good God Almighty, with all power, with heaven and earth in his hand, good God Almighty, he said in his holy word, church, Good God Almighty, he's coming back. Yes. Uh, one yes. of these no days out yes. the church. Yes. Uh, and my yes. question to you, uh, will you be ready? Uh, yes. We'll stretch out on the yes. Lord here. Uh, yes. Good God Almighty, I'm ready to go now. Uh, I've been having too many heartaches yes. uh, and yes. too yes. many pain. Mm. But I'm ready. Yes. Amen. Go, Lord. Amen. Any yeah. all right? Yeah, yeah. 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 Yes. Woo! Have you made a way? Oh, yeah. Yes. My God has made a way for me. Yeah. Hey! Good God of my reason myself like a do church. God has made a way. Yes. Hey! Have you made a way for somebody? Come on, yes. Oh yeah, I feel free today. Yes, sir. I feel free. Yes, sir. I feel free. Yes, sir. Oh yeah, I know a man. Yes, sir. Yes. And got some broad shoulders. Yes. Got a on it. Mm. When everything is going wrong. Yes. Woo! Man. He's all right, Deacon Walker. Yes, sir. Yes. He's all right, Deacon. He's all right. He's all right. He's all right. He's all right. I started 
of my mind. I'm not cheating no more. I'm going back to church, y'all. I'm gonna walk right through the door. I got a clean up day. Well, I messed up my Lord. I started my life over and over. Oh, I got a clean up at the hand. Yeah, I started my life over again. Those of you that feel like I do, let's do better. Hey, I think I say one more time, Trey. Hey, those of you that feel like I do, let's do better. But I messed up Yeah, Lord Yeah, if I started my life Over a goal I gotta heal Yes, I have But I messed up My Lord Yeah, if I started my life Over a goal I gotta heal Yes, I have But I messed up My Lord Yeah, if I started my life God in the church. Let me see you raise your hand. Have you made a way? Talk about it on today. Oh, he made a way out of no way. Hey! And one thing I like about the church, he said he's going away to prepare a place for. But one of these old days, he said he's coming back again. How many of you glad that he's coming back? Hey! Hey! We got to clean up. Yeah. What a mess up. My Lord. Yeah. I started my life over But I messed up. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I started my life over again. Hey, hey, all right. Glory to His name. Praise His holy name.